Alright, so today we're going to be doing something different today. You know, everybody's reacting to um, Kendrick Lamar's music video and everything else like that. I'm not trying to chop it up and all that other stuff because I would like you guys to actually see the whole thing. But everybody's probably already seen it. So today we're going to be watching the news. We're going to be watching who produced it, who was on the track, who helped with the video because the video was dope. Um, again, uh, shout, shout out to all my ninjas and Kinoichis. Let's get into the video. Before the video starts, please like, comment, or subscribe, assassinate that like button. If you don't like my videos, give it a thumbs down. If you like them, just give them a thumbs up. Easy, simple. Let's get it. What's up? You're tuned into I'm about to say, why is my shit dark? Cat Passion. Yesterday, the internet went crazy when Kendrick Lamar dropped his new music video, Humble. This is the second yeah, I, I went crazy. upcoming album, which is apparently dropping next week, April 7th. Can't this wait for it either. By Mike Will made it, and the video was directed by Dave Myers and the Little Homies. This music video was exquisite. More than exquisite. Vibrant visuals. It's crazy. Even recreated the Last Supper. Another visually stimulating scene that I liked from the music video was when Kendrick's head was on fire and he was staring down into the camera. This song is clearly commanding the listener or certain rappers to sit down and be humble. Hey, I'm the realest nigga at the all. Bitch, be humble. One of my favorite parts of the music video is when Kendrick raps I'm so fucking sick and tired of the Photoshop They show a beautiful girl dolled up to the max in one picture frame She then walks into the next frame and she's in her natural state In a previous interview with the New York Times Kendrick had stated that his next album would be based around God It is interesting that he started the first scene of the music video in a church dressed as a Pope I'm really excited to see the rest of the visuals off this album, and I can't wait to hear this project. A new single dropped this morning. By I don't need to hear all that. I just want to hear about Kendrick. Okay, I don't know about you guys, but one, I'm excited for his album because one, he's always telling a story. He's always giving us a lesson about something. Like when it comes to Good Kid, Mad City, he was telling us about his life. He was giving us lessons, uh, telling us stuff what to do and not what not to do. And then, you know, on Pimp Butterfly, you know, he gave us. Um, lessons just for the world, lessons on what life really means, on um, how to accept ourselves, how to love ourselves, and um, you know not to to have hate towards each other. And I, when I say us, I mean uh, black people as a whole. Now, some people might get offended. I don't understand why, but you can if you want to. That's that's your problem. But um, other than that, everybody's brought together by love, period. That's what we're, everybody's brought together by. And even on, you know, I love myself, which he's referring to everybody that says it. Like, if you sing the song, you're saying, I love myself. But you're not just singing the song. You're actually saying it to yourself if you actually think about it. So that's just, like, minor things that he's telling us. And another thing is he's rapping about God. And that's something that I wanted to do. Well, that I actually am doing, but I just didn't drop anything about that. So I'm actually glad that somebody at this high of, of level that's on this type of platform is actually doing that. Because a lot of other people are too scared to do it. A lot of other people are scared to even bring religion out. A lot of people are scared to even talk about religion because, you know, religion is a touchy subject. But if you think about it, it's like any other subject. Now, if you think about it, which one is actually even more to discuss, like, which is worse to actually discuss? The talking about a president or talking about religion where we can actually help everybody out? One person, where, if we're talking about the president, we're talking about one individual that has a opinions just like everybody else and on the other hand we're talking about religion where it can go through anybody and through everybody out the whole world and we can change our future just by you know going into our beliefs and actually combining with each other and actually helping each other just by one word which is love and which is without you know fighting or hate and all this other stuff that is dividing us as just a people and like race is an, another one that divides us, um, religion, uh, uh, different aspects uh, uh, and insights on life. And like there's so much stuff that's so negative and we don't even have to focus on this type of stuff. But if you look at it, if you're having a conversation, a lot of people get brought together by 
just video games, talking about video games, talking about movies, talking about different TV shows, talking about clothes, shoes. If you name all these other stuff, we have so much positive that brings everybody together as a whole. But then at the, at the same time, we have a lot of things that just divides us. And we fall into that hole. That's something we should not do. But, you know, it's just, to me, I'm just waiting to see what he has in store for us, what he's going to say on this album. But, Hamadi, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace, love, positivity. I'll see you guys in the next video. Assassinate that like button. Become part of the Ninja family or subscribe to me. And, you know, let's add. Let's add to this family. I want, us to, I want it to grow for it to become a positive community. There's going to be negatives, but I want it to grow and be positive. I'm going to keep... I'm going to keep throwing out videos. Even though it's like reaction videos like this, I've been doing these on the go because I've been going to work. And, you know, these are the quickest videos I can do, but also try to say what I want to say. Even right now, I'm supposed to been, I was supposed to leave for work, but I do this for you guys. And I make sure I'm going to keep doing it for you guys. And I'm going to do it because I love doing this. You know, videos, music, all this. So, I'll see you guys later. Peace.